Welcome to Air Force Officer Qualifying Test Prep AFOQT online lesson series Bullock Counting. Before you start, make sure that you have a pen and a notebook so you could write some very important information from the video. In this lesson, we'll go over counting blocks touching a certain block. So make sure that you watch the video a few times and then download this application called AAF OQT Tutoring App from App Store or Google Play and it has block counting section so you could practice more practice problem and take practice test on it and make sure that you get 80% or higher on your practice test. So let's get started. This part of this test will measure your ability to understand a three-dimensional pile of blocks. You'll be given a certain number of blocks and your task is to determine how many other blocks is touches. The block that only contact the corner do not count. And also all the blocks in each pile are the same size and same shape. If you have a rectangular size of block so all of them will be rectangular or circular or square okay so you could see here here is an example so there are um five blocks in a pile of blocks it has five portion block one two three four five you need to find how many other blocks is connected with um, block one by surface not with corner okay so it's, Keep that in mind. The first question in here, how many other blocks touches with block number one? So easy way you could do it, always look the block like a straight. Then look at the number straight. Then you could see there is no block in the front and also in the back. So you need to consider um, left, right, up and down. Okay. So you could see here in the right side, you have only one. There is no in the left side, there is no in the top, in the bottom you have one, two. So there are total three blocks are touched with block number one. So block one touches three other blocks. The correct answer is C, here is three. Now question number two, you see number two. So same way, look the block number here from um, like a straight. So now you could see here, um, there is no other block is con connected with um, front and also in the back. But uh, you could see here in the right side one and also on the top you have one, two and also in the bottom you have this and that. So there are total five blocks are touched with block two. So block two touched five other blocks. So you could see here the correct answer is B is five are connected with other blocks. Next is number three. So you could see here, same way, look at the front, okay, straight. So how many blocks in the left, right, top and bottom? So right side you have only one, on the top you have one, two, on the bottom you have one, two, three. So total six blocks. So the correct answer is letter D, number six. Next is uh, question number four. The same way, make sure that you look the um, block straight to the number and then you have the, on the top side you have one um, and this one is two. On the right side you have one and two. So there are four blocks touched number, block number four. Now, block number five, you could see here exactly same way. Look um, in the front side of the number, right? So you could see here the right side one, top side one, left side one. So there are three blocks are tasked with block number five. The correct answer is letter E, number three. So this is the way how to find out. If you don't understand, watch the video a couple of more times to make sure that you understand the concept. Here is a practice problem. You could try by yourself. You could see here this, this is a block number from 6 to 10. So 
you could see here this block is a little bit different than the other one so you have like a different combination make sure that you understand watch the video a couple of times and try by yourself make sure that it matches the answer so we have the answer option at the end you could see here this is the all this correct answer from this um the question you have in here so you practice by yourself and make sure that you you understand every single problem in here and then um, download this application as i mentioned before uh, aap oqt tutoring app take the practice test at least a few times to get 80 percent or higher that will help you to prepare for that particular section